you know, they may be what, five mil thick maximum, that abdominal wall, you reckon? Okay. So, so I'd be pretty aware of, yeah, obviously how deep you're going with this. So you're using a 13 mil? Yep, 13 mil, yeah. And then it's really, th so there's the, I'm hooking under the bottom of those, those ribs there, that costal cartilage, and then down here and onto there. And so then do some flat cross fibre, palpation. above, <coughs> 13, and then depending on what you, how confident you are with your, your needle feel and things like that, I'll just pass through that tissue, so I'm already just hitting that abdominal, sort of that fascia of the muscle, so I'm just sitting in that there, and you'll find that as I pull that, so if that wasn't in the fascia of the muscle, that needle would likely move with the skin, whereas see how it's not because the tip of it's stuck. So obviously we've passed through just into that fascia there. Okay, so I'm using a 30 with him. And then we can come down onto here. And again, needle on that, um, that oblique angle quarterly. Still passing through there. You right, Sam? Yeah. yeah. So sometimes <laughs> things, that, things that I find work, that work really well in trying to settle things down as well with this type of stuff is that if you are using more of a superficial technique, then what you can actually do is you can actually do a little bit of, if you're going to treat somewhere else, you could treat that while they're sitting in there or you do some gentle movement or some gentle movement through the fascia so that that needle tip that's sitting right on the um, external fascia of that muscle, that really innovated area, you can still create a bit of sort of irritation through there or stimulation with the needle tip, which will then create that nociceptive feedback to the brain and help with desensitisation of that, that area neurologically, but also um, helping to try and uh, deactivate the trigger points and stuff. Yeah.